putting on the gel now, Luna. Okay. I'm just going to move this along the tummy like before, and Dr. Sparrow will have a look and see how the baby's doing, okay? Yeah. Can you give me some more depth? And just a little more pressure now. Why aren't they saying anything, Keith? How are we doing there, Doc? Just bear with me. Oh, God, Keith, it's something bad. Can you tell us, please? I'm sorry. I can't detect a heartbeat. No. Please, no. I'm very sorry. <laughs> edge of the fetus, we will need to perform a DNC or an AORPC. Now, Gronia has an information sheet, but essentially it is a one-day procedure and won't be detrimental to any future pregnancies. When would I have to? As soon as possible. Now? No. But we would need to make an appointment sometime in the next few days. Now, what I would suggest is that you go home and allow yourself some private time and then contact us. Okay. Again, you have our sympathies. I'm sorry, I didn't mean to wake me. No, no. I wasn't really asleep. Do you want a cup of coffee or a tea or something? No, thanks. Would you want something stronger? I mean, is it okay to... Oh. What difference could it make now, Keith? I still can't believe it. I know they said it was serious, but like you said, they have all this technology and... Yeah, well, I guess it was just ourselves we were feeling, wasn't it? It's a great day for you and you met me. Don't be silly. Come on, Keith. This is not the kind of thing you wanted. Who would? You know what I mean. You like things fun and light. Not this. I'm really sorry. I screwed up on you, on the baby. No, you did. You did. We had a split. Do you want me to go and get you some? Do you not have any? No. Look, I'll pop out to the chemist and get some. Thanks. Right, I won't be long, okay? There you go. Thanks. He'll be back soon. He's just having the one. I wouldn't blame him if he got locked. God, Ray. I brought him nothing but grief. Hey. None of this is your fault. I don't know. It's not. I mean, it's, it's God, our nature, our genetics, but... It wasn't nothing to do with you. You really think? I didn't ask her if it was a boy or a girl. What do you think? A boy. I always felt it was a boy. Then it was a boy. Matthew. I was going to call him Matthew after me, Dad. But you still can. You don't think it's stupid? He was your baby, no matter how short a time. I think Matthew is a lovely name. How's the head? Better. Uh, I'm gonna put on a cup. Anybody want one? Ah, uh, yeah, Grant. I better head off. What are you going? I need to get some sleep. Just, just stay here. You can't be on your own tonight. Okay. I can keep on the sofa. All right. Thanks. You don't mind if I... No, no, walk away. Do you want me to get you anything? No, thanks. Night. Yeah, good night. Good night, Ray. Good night, love. 
you want me to go offside? What? Well, so you can bed down. No, no, you're grand. I don't think I'll be doing much sleeping anyway. Do you know if you hurry, you'll catch the last point. Ah, no, no, some grand where I am. Why don't we open a couple of beers and watch some football? Yeah, go on, that'll do. Yeah, thanks. Long day, huh? You said it. How are you? Fine. I had a look in you earlier. You were flat out. Didn't want to awaken you. You okay? Yeah. Well, no, not really. Sit down and have a cup of tea. Thanks. I don't want to keep you. Ah, you're always. I couldn't sleep. Hospitals. So there's nothing to worry about, is there? It's just a routine procedure. I mean, it's not dangerous or anything. No. It happens all the time, apparently. So what do you have to do? Well, I have to be in at nine. And I've got to take these tablets first thing in the morning to start the contractions. And they warn me it'd be sore. So i better get a taxi. That's OK. I'll drive you. Would you? Yeah, of course I will. Look, you can stay here tonight and I'll drive you in the morning. That'd be great. I don't want to ask my parents. It's not that they'd mind. I just don't want to have to answer a load of questions. Yeah, no. Thanks, Keith. For what? For how you're being. <laughs> Go on, Ella. Come on, I'll give you a lift. See you here. Oh, Keith, I uh, I wanted to call you, but I, I didn't know if it was the right time. Well. Oh. Oh God, I'm so sorry. Well, that's the way it goes. I, I I don't even know what to say to you. You should already. There's not much you can say. Luna has to go to hospital tomorrow for this DNC thing. She's dreading it. I can't blame her. Oh God, love her. Uh, how are you? You know me. You look wrecked. Thanks. I made an effort. Hmm. Oh, I'm sorry. Listen here. Um, it's Jan. No, you're fine. I have to get in. I might see you across the road later, yeah? Yeah, OK. Well, just take care of yourself, yeah? Yeah. See you. See you. Come on, it's me. I'm going to talk if you don't want to. I could just sit and watch football. Neve, there's something I have to ask you. Sure. Have you ever thought about having kids? Me? No, well... Yeah, sometime. Why? You see, here's the thing. I didn't. I never even thought about it. Well, I'm sure you'd make a great dad. Yeah. Yeah. You're messing. No, I'm not being serious. Well, one day I thought I was going to be a dad. Yeah. Yeah. It's good. It's stupid, isn't it? How can you miss someone you don't even know? I don't know. I'm sure it's possible, though. Ah, maybe it's better this way. It's probably for the best. Look, do you know what? I'm no expert. But sometimes things get messy, and that's just it. It's the way life is. 